know guys engine oil pan is finally out I, I do have some advice um, I know usually they say you cannot pull this oil pan out with the struggle and I do mean it you can actually pull it out but this piece here that I'm holding it's actually located right beneath uh, the uh, it's right beneath it's attached to the block at the, at the bottom where all the uh, crankshaft stuff is and it sort of sits like this inside and what happens is it's actually bumping and if you're trying to pull this forward it's bumping right into this so the solution is to undo these four bolts that's inside it's going to be very difficult to do but they're eight millimeter bolts so you would have to actually go back um, where the transmission bay is if you have the transmission removed like I do it was a lot simpler because um, I'm actually trying to remove the third converter and so what I did is I actually lifted up the engine and put a block underneath the torque converter to kind of loosen the pressure from the oil pan and I had to kind of work with it I had to raise it lower just so I could you know pull it out which takes some strength and uh, I did it without using a jack so that means um, you know most of you guys could do it I'm not a pretty big guy um, but basically yeah undo these four bolts from the back and you'll be able to actually remove it I do want to mention another thing this is located at the bottom of the transmission it has a sensor uh, I mean excuse me tra not the transmission uh, the oil pan on the engine so just fold this piece out I do recommend uh, just undo the bolt pull it out of there because it will be in the way because it's sort of like sticking up too and you don't want it to be like in a way when you're trying to undo these bolts it might actually be in the way to where it's going to be hard to reach the bolts and once the transmission is all loose it's going to be hard to really get this thing out of, I mean this thing out of there because it's uh everything else is going to be uh in the way um uh the steering column stuff um well anyways this concludes the video I hope this helps somebody it is a difficult way to remove it I don't recommend doing it this way um, I think to, to, the, to do the um, engine oil pan remove the engine completely with the transmission and just do it like that because this is this is not easy this makes the job a lot harder so thank you guys for watching this video hope to see you next time bye bye